give you a few minutes. Now, if we had everyone in here now, welcome. So we need we need you to take a, a sheet of paper with the M's on it to help us sing. Sound sheet. Okay. Sound sheet. <laughs> All right, everyone got one. All right. This is a very uh, special occasion for our church and uh, the Lord has given us a beautiful afternoon for this special occasion as well. Uh, we ask, this is sort of a short notice thing because uh, next week we are hoping to have a contractor here to do some ground preparation for the construction of our new sanctuary. And we welcome you here. And uh, we want you to sing with us a hymn entitled A Glorious Church. And after we sing that hymn, we will have others that will participate in this sod turning ceremony this afternoon. Before we go any further, let's sing together uh, A Glorious Church. Let's sing it then, Joe. Do you hear them coming, brother?
come at this time and to read to us a portion of scripture that would be very fitting uh, for this occasion this afternoon. And Jacob went out from Beersheba and went unto Harlan. And he lighted upon a certain place and tarried there all night, because the sun was set. And he took off the stones of that place and put them for his pillows and lay down in that place to sleep. And he dreamed, and behold, a ladder set up on earth, and the top of it reached to heaven. And behold, the angels of God ascending and descending on it. And behold, the Lord stood above it and said, I am the Lord God of Abraham thy father, and the God of Isaac. The land whereon thou liest to thee will I give it unto thy seed. And thy seed shall be as the dust of the earth, and thou shalt spread abroad to the west, to the east, to the north, to the south. And in thee and in thy seed shall all the families of God-turning ceremony, and we feel that the Lord has been with us uh, this far in our plans uh, for a new sanctuary here uh, on this hill, and we believe that God has greater things in store for us as we purpose in our hearts to build a sanctuary, a new sanctuary, unto the Lord. This sanctuary will house approximately 270 filled to capacity. The main sanctuary uh, will seat 152. The overflow will seat 96. We'll have room for at least a 20-person choir member on the platform of our <coughs> new sanctuary, plus an area set aside for six uh, musicians and orchestra in our church. The uh, new sanctuary will have some Ten new classrooms for the instruction of our children in uh, Sunday school each Sunday morning and the total square footage of our new building will be some 5,384 square feet. It will cost us in the vicinity of some $380,000 but we believe that the good hand of the Lord is upon us and these needs will be We are going to turn the sod uh, to officially uh, consecrate this ground for the purpose of our new sanctuary. And I feel good within my heart already that God's presence is here and that the Lord will be with us as we build this new sanctuary unto the glory of God. just two other verses that I want to mention before we uh, turn this on. Very applicable to this afternoon and to what we are about <coughs> and to what we are doing here. Listen to these two verses of scripture. The first is found in Psalm 115 and verse 16 it says, the heaven and even the heavens are the Lord's, but the earth hath he given to the children of men. In 1 Chronicles 22 and 19 is a charge to us this afternoon. Is not the Lord your God with you? And hath not he given you rest on every side? Now set your heart and your soul to seek the Lord your God. Arise therefore 
and build ye the sanctuary of the Lord your God. Amen. 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 What we're going to do this afternoon is have the oldest sister in the assembly, the oldest brother in the assembly, along with one of the children of the assembly, and myself, to take hold of the shovel and to turn the sod as we uh, dedicate this hill and this part of our land unto the glory of God and in preparation for the construction of our new church. Sister Stringer, will you come please? Brother Chesley Smith, God bless you. And one of the little ones. Okay, Krista, God bless you. And take hold of the shovel, each one of you. Sister Stringer saw the construction of the first church, the first Pentecostal church in Clarenville. God has blessed her soul that she uh, will see the construction, the beginning of the construction of our, is it third? Third sanctuary here in Clarenville. Brother Smith, turn around so that the folks can see you. This young lady, will you step outside of sisters? There you are, take a hold of the shovel there. Now then, all right. Now we gotta turn this over as they take pictures. Can we do that, I wonder? Okay, think we can, let's lift it. Okay, you got it? Okay, you want us to do that again? <laughs> we gotta do that again. Okay, okay, you ready? Okay, you ready? Okay, this way this time. Very well. You want to stand for further photos? Or are you finished? Okay. God bless you. We're going to we're going to sing one more hymn, but we want everybody to come together. Uh, we will have this special occasion put in the local newspaper, the packet, in the very near future. So we want as many as possible to be in the in the photo with us. And uh, we want to publicize what is happening here in our church in Clarenville. Thank you so much. Let's sing the last hymn. And uh, then we'll have Sister Seward to lead us in a closing prayer. But before everyone moves away, we'll stand for one more photo. Is that what you want? There shall be showers of blessing. I believe that the blessing of God will fall upon us in a greater manner here in this new sanctuary.
will you come here please and let's join together as she leads us in a closing prayer and after she does we don't want you to leave right away we want you to stay as we just uh, get in a different formation for another picture uh, to pass on to the packet here in
What do you think about Dave? <laughs> Looks pretty good, eh? Yeah, very good job. A good job. Boy, what a day. This is some day. I guess we'll say see you to the tractor now. This is Duro. Hey. This is September the 11th, brother. Yes, boy. You know what you're doing? Oh, uh, I don't think so. You're the hardest working man here, I think. Uh, I'm the only fellow working here yet, though. <laughs> uh, some more coming on Monday. I dare say. You guys are putting in the plumbing here. Doobie's rental. They have the line site uh, repaired and uh, holes dug now for the uh, entrance of the church. Footings and cross bombs poured and uh, feel compacted inside. We have the plumbers working now, uh, putting in the main water and sewer line. And Mr. Pedal is the operator of that big crane. Place of abode for the next five to six weeks. It's a beautiful day today, September the 11th. Next week things will go in full production, full speed ahead. So that's it for today. To take one more shot of Mr. Pedal full stop. Doing a good job. He knows what he's doing. He looks like a man. He knows what he's doing. of September. Beautiful, beautiful sun, uh, Monday afternoon. Starting some of the construction work now. On the ground, there's the cafe.
Catholic Church, across the street from us. Some of the carpenters, Jason and Barry, girl. Getting the wall pretty. The wall is facing the road. This is the uh, 15th of September. The boys are sticking up a wall. One of the sides, inside side of the church. Mr. Twine trying to straighten them out there now. He's trying to tell them which way it's supposed to go. It's going to work. It will work. There's Mr. Alistair. I think they're going to try it again. They're going to get that wall up in a minute. Guaranteed. What a beautiful day. This is a tremendous day. There it goes again. The front wall, partially up, looking good. That's going to be the main entrance right there. There it goes. September the 21st, Monday morning. There's David there, getting the rafters hoisted. Up there, and I had a hundred 
good crane. There's a grain truck. Crane operators here somewhere. Stick them. There's the operator again. Lookers here. Can you identify that from there in the white ear? White ear? Who is it? I believe he's the foreman. No, 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 that's Calvin. <laughs> now he's getting another one. Looking good, boys. Looking good. You two men really know what you're doing. I know you do. That's it, sir. There it goes. has a hundred foot reach. It's a long way up there, isn't it? side
inside the building, huh? Come on, get in there! Come on, boy! Come on, boy! Now we can walk across them, sir. Now we can. There's a two over there. You can recognize that man there. Hey, good enough, Chase? Hey! Hey! <laughs> Don't fall off! There's the inside of the building now. That's going, that's going to be the front of the church right there. See the beginnings of the baptismal tank. To be under the platform. You also have to click these off. If you're a kid up here, I'll have a load, see? Alright? If you're a kid up here, I'll have a load. That's the entrance of the church right there. Say hello again, buddy. Hey! Say hello again, Jason. <laughs> but now they'll have the rest of the raft rafters up in the morning. I don't know if we can see where that truck is coming out. Drop it on your head now.
Hey! <laughs> There goes another one. Ready for speaking. Looking good. Looking good, Chase. You recognize those two fellas? Sizing up the land. <laughs> Chase! <laughs> David! How are you getting on? Don't fall, sir. Don't fall. <laughs> no good to heat, sir. It's no good to heat. If you have to fall, if you have to fall, we got a couple of guys to stand by. Yeah. <laughs> okay. That's the main thing. Yes, sir. Nice honey, my fellow from here, you'll get a lot of money for that video. Would I? <laughs> you know, America's funniest. America's yeah. Funniest. <laughs> Takes care of it for the day. The boys will have a lot of dumb, lot done by the time it's closing time this evening. They're doing a good job. Good job, Mr. Massey. Okay, this is Monday afternoon, the same day, and looks like they're doing really well. Excellent job. As you can see, they, they got the three parts done. Or just about. Beautiful, beautiful Monday afternoon. A good nest for a better day for this. It's going to be a beautiful sanctuary. I get a sense and feeling that God's glory is going to fall here in an unprecedented manner. The souls will be saved. Baptized into the Holy Ghost, the sick raised to health, and people being delivered from the shackles of bondage and sin. That's before the Lord returns for his church. I feel it. Praise God. There's the remaining roof truss that they have to put up. And I would say that they'll have them on the building before sunset this evening.
this is September the 29th. And beautiful day that it is. You can see that the boys are putting on the um, entrance over the main sanctuary. It's going to be a good job. They're breaking for dinner now. And uh, in a moment, I'll join with them in the trailer. They have a little surprise for someone. See you in a while. <laughs> That's his birthday cake. Happy birthday. How old are you, sir? What? How old are you? Oh, just a spring's chick. <laughs> Put it this way, I'm over at home and hitting them the other way. Is that right? Yeah, but it's a good ride. <laughs> Good ride, is it? Good ride, yeah. That's the main thing. <laughs> so happy birthday to you now. Boys got to sing happy birthday to you. No, no, no. I, think. No, I, I don't know. I, I, I'm, I'm a very strong person. I don't know how much I can take. Where's that cake to, boys? Sit down and look. There's the cake. There, get away. There, she's the cake. 